So today I'm going to be making a little teapot. It's going to be as spherical as a shape as I can get it. Um, and then right now I'm throwing the base and then I'll throw the lid and the spout and I'll pull the handle. So I have all the parts for my teapot right here, the base and the couple spots that I threw and the lid and the handles. So right now I'm just attaching my spout, as you can see, it's turning out pretty well. And then I'm going to attach my handle because unfortunately I had to re-throw my lid because it um, didn't fit well. First time I threw it. Um, right now I'm just attaching this little handle, little knob handle to my lid. It's super nice. So here's my finished teapot. I think it turned out really nice. Uh, the lid, the rim on it is a little bit thin, so that's a little worrisome. But other than that, it turned out really nice. It's actually really light. It's probably one of the lightest teapots I've ever made. And the base turned out really nice. Put a little lip there. Didn't turn out exactly like spherical, but it's pretty close. So I'm happy with it. Now we're gonna bisque fire it and see how it turns out. So right here is my finished teapot, all glazed and fired. And the glaze turned out really nice. The this glaze has kind of crystallization effects, so it turns into blue with these kind of crystals on the surface makes a really cool design. Now let's see how it pours. Hmm. Pours pretty well. Yeah. Pours very well. I really like the spout. I think it turned out really nice. I hope you enjoy this video and watching me make this teapot. Don't forget to subscribe!